Well, let's play this out logically then, Mr. Spock. Firstly, I will kill your captain to demonstrate my resolve. Then, if yours holds, I will have no choice but to kill you and your entire crew. If you destroy our ship, you will also destroy your own people. Your crew requires oxygen to survive. Mine does not. I will target your life support systems located behind the aft nacelle. And after every single person aboard your ship suffocates, I will walk over your cove corpses to recover my people. You're going to do this for me? I'm going to clip your nuts. Like I clip your daddies. You're not going to marry my sister. I don't think it's up to you. Shut up. Tell me to shut you up. Say another word, old man, and I will rip your head off your shoulders. What do you want? Your life. I was thinking about taking it. That right. But I don't do so well in tight spaces, so going to prison worries me. Me. <laughs> Next time I'll deflate all your balls, friend. I know what I must do. I will shred this universe down to its last atom. And then, with the stones you've collected for me, create a new one, teeming with life that knows not what it has lost, but only what it has been given. A grateful universe. Born out of blood. They'll never know it. Because you won't be alive to tell them. Get out of here, freak. You hear me? That little suit's gonna get all full of blood. Mine are yours. You spill the secret family recipe today. Maybe you fucking spill about me tomorrow. Is that something? Maybe that's a possibility? I was just saying. Just saying. Could get you buried real fucking quick. If you let my daughter go now, that'll be the end of it. I will not look for you. I will not pursue you. But if you don't, I will look for you. I will find you. And I will kill you.